Welcome to Tales from SYL Ranch, where everyone is entitled to my opinion, and I'm Bill Stone. Now, due to AOC's provincialism, I extend to her an offer, and I hope that maybe she's watching, or maybe a viewer who knows her would pass along the video. And I'm going to do this with the utmost respect, which I often don't do on this show. I have to say to you, Congressman Ocasio-Cortez, I note that your knowledge, you're ill-informed of the science behind modern agriculture and how those of us in flyover country produce food not just for the world, but also the United States. And as proposed, your Green New Deal would cut agricultural productivity in the U.S. by about 75 percent, leading to the death by starvation of upwards of a billion people on Earth. Many of these would be from your own district. Now, the reason for this is basically impossible to explain to someone who's never been or spent time in an agricultural area. So I would extend to you this offer. If you will meet me at the Rapid City, South Dakota Regional Airport and give me just a couple of days, I will give you a tour of modern working ranch land. You'll be able to see the science for yourself, as well as come to an understanding of how your Green New Deal was so negatively impacted. Now, I would also give you a tour of the Pine Ridge Indian Reservation, consistently rated the number one slum in America, and most people have no conception of just how bad the res is. Now, I'm retired, so I am at your disposal at any time. I am capable of passing a federal background check, which is something I had to do for IT work, and you would, of course, be welcome to bring whatever security detail you thought was appropriate. Now, I would advise against bringing a large party to the res. Its residents are not particularly um, inviting to non-Native Americans and particularly federal politicians. Their history with the federal government is all negative for 150 years. If you show up with a large party, it dredges up all kinds of horrible memories. For example, the kidnapping of Native American children and their forced placement into white foster homes that was a commonplace practice as late as the 1980s. So in any case, I am at your disposal, and I would very much enjoy your company for a brief tour of rural South Dakota. And by the way, for my relatives, no, I will not be showing her any of the places we'd rather keep private. You know what I'm talking about. So that is all I really have to say about that subject for today. So if you like what I'm doing, I would really like to see your comments, and I'd love to respond back to them. And if you like what I'm doing, please like this video, subscribe to my channel. I particularly would hope that you would do that. I am 30 subs shy of 100 subs at this point, and I would really like to get that 100 sub mark because it would give me a personalized URL on YouTube, which is really important when I'm trying to market my show. And you can also, you know, aside from subscribing to the channel, you can like the video, share me on social media, and to tell all of your friends, family, neighbors, pets, and livestock to do the same. I would certainly appreciate your support, either via PayPal, Subscribestar, or a place on my website where you can support me further, and there are links to all of these in my description box below. So thanks for watching Tales from SYL Ranch, and remember, for a breath of fresh air, watch Tales from SYL Ranch, where everyone is entitled to my opinion. And I'm Bill Stone. Ultimate power in this world has always been one simple thing, the control and manipulation of minds.